Tu încerci să te închizi. Da. 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 Whenever you dream, you just only remember it, you know, that Krishna is the taste of water. Yes. And basically, Shtapapad, he by saying to him this, he was raising his consciousness to come to the yeah. internet. He said, I, I, if I remember correctly, he actually says, when you drink the alcohol, you should remember that Krishna is the actual taste of that. Yeah. that, that. <laughs> it's very amazing. You remind me of a point I was going to mention. So Peter Verbosch, for example, who um, was a tennis star. So he was engaged in Krishna consciousness, you know, practicing Krishna consciousness, and he was telling people about Krishna consciousness. And then he, had, he lost over a million pounds worth of contracts because of it. And he told me, Prabhupada said, so therefore don't, don't let people know that you're a devotee. And Prabhupada told him, said, for you, preach vegetarianism. You know, like that. George Harrison wanted to, you know, shave up Join the movement. Could you imagine it? The Beatles joined Bhaktivedanta Man. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Prabhupada saw, part of it was also, in terms of principles, maybe they were producing difficulty in following everything. Prabhupada said, no, no, for you, stay outside, but in that way, you yourself, you help to spread the movement. So Prabhupada was so pragmatic. So, but it's a catch, it's not black and white, it's a careful balance. Not using being pragmatic as an excuse to being deviant or not being chaste. But at the same time, not going to the other extreme where there's only one way and then the whole world is falling, is going to hell. But you know, we're okay because we're preaching Christian consciousness and we don't care. No, we do care. Because actually speaking, the people that, they, that are going to hell, we're not different from those people. Okay? We, we, can't, we cannot begin to ever think that we're below another people. You want to be saved in spiritual life? Always consider yourself at the feet and at the mercy of the Vaishnavas. Then and only then is our spiritual life guaranteed, not otherwise. Mm -hmm. It's this point about attachment is so is so dangerous. We become attached to something. We're not we lack humility. So therefore we think that what we're doing is the best thing. Then when we think it's the best thing, we look down on other, on other people, on other devotees. Therefore we we can criticize them because they're inferior to us. And therefore you just fall down. And therefore you see that some of the most advanced and empowered devotees, they're no longer even practicing. And, don't, and make no mistake, it wasn't that they were powerful. It wasn't that they weren't advanced. They were advanced. And they were empowered. And the way that they spread the movement would, show, would, would kind of bring tears to our eyes if we saw it now. It was real. But at a certain point, when the, when the influence goes up and the humility doesn't count, doesn't balance it, the humility and the compassion doesn't balance it, then you get imbalanced and then you fall down. Punam Vishikobhava. You become like a mouse. You're, you were once a lion, but now you just become a mouse. Yeah. It's part, just past 8 40, so I have to stop. Thank you very much for your uh, tolerance and all glories to all of you for your amazing dedication to your Prabhupada Sankirtan mission. Uh, Sankirtan devotees, ki Shri Prabhupada, ki Distribution Marathon Key, Jai Nita Gopram Nandi, Shri Prabhupada Ki So we can share a moment of silence together <laughs> in hopes that one day we'll have a story to tell about 
what distribution. Uh, I'll just read uh, something that uh, Thorin and Shibramar sent. Um, what distribution complex. I haven't read it through yet, so let's see. Uh, just as, just as, sorry, it's called Faith in Krishna's Empowerment is the Key. <coughs> Uh, just as faith, faith is the essence of devotional service, faith is also the essence of book distribution. And devotees can approach book distribution in two ways, having faith in their abilities or having faith in Krishna's ability to empower. Faith or lack of faith in our abilities means that we depend on our karma. If our propensity is to sell, we may be able to sell many books. But, if such a salesman is not humble and devoted, he may fall down by identifying material ability with Krishna consciousness. If we do not have such ability to sell, then our results are more limited. But if those with less knack or nature for selling, upon hearing how others distribute many books, like 100 maha books a day, say, I can never do that they also fall down. That is because they identify material inability with Krishna consciousness. Everyone's with me on this so far? <laughs> the key is to have faith in Krishna's ability to empower anyone. If one has karma to sell, one should have faith that Krishna's empowerment is already there and seek to increase that empowerment by pure desire and by being a pure instrument. If one does not have the karma to sell, one should have faith that Krishna can do anything. Then, sorry, that then, that then gives way for Krishna's empowerment to manifest. That means not getting in the way. How, when, and to what degree that empowerment takes place is up to Krishna. It is not a formula that you will automatically sell 100 Maha big books. But it is that it is the mentality that will enable you to be empowered or to do so. So let us take Krishna's instruction to heart as he states it in Bhagavad Gita 1856 through 59. Then by his grace we will be successful in our effort to glorify him and to distribute many books. Just don't let ability or lack of ability get in the way. He is the real ability, and his ability is unlimited. Too many, that's about. You have one? Yeah, you want to come and talk? <laughs>